I remember years ago when I was in a local uh, drug and alcohol court program. This was a very long time ago, actually. It was uh, 20, uh, 2009 to 2011. I participated in that. They forced me to go to counseling with uh, certain licensed counselors. Anybody can check my older videos from more than a year ago when I said that I think it's quite possible that flat earth is a psyop, not because the earth is not flat or not moving. No, absolutely not. I said I believe it may be a psyop for that very reason and a distraction for that very reason because it's static and not a ball. So it may be a rollout. It's, it's static and not a ball. And a distraction for that very reason because it's static and not a ball. He has to say about it and I think everybody's going to be uh, if you're not familiar with this topic um, maybe surprised maybe you won't be all that surprised if you're familiar with the general area that we're going in so um, without any further ado I'd like to uh, welcome Bob from Zionist protocols and a number of usually banned truth seeker channels and currently the 12 XU channel. So, Bob, thank you for joining me today. Thanks, John. Do I call I'm you John? Jonathan? What do I call you? John's good. Yeah. John's good? John's good. John's good or just John? John. Oh, okay. Yeah. John. <laughs> John or John's good. You didn't want to work. All right, John's good. Um, Besides, you know, just the paintings, the art, and the sculpture, the Renaissance was a time of introducing what seemed to be like, at least on a European-wide scale, a lot of ways of thinking, a lot of uh, philosophy. Of trick was, at a point, I started taking the material that came in front of me and I started thinking about it. And that's kind of the biggest thing right there is critically thinking. Nobody, nobody exercises critical thinking anymore. They don't teach critical thinking anymore. No. They don't want 